Love means never having to say you're sorry, though actually it does. If you know what I'm referring to, then you likely remember Love Story, the hit film that swept the country back in the 70s. The movie had three stars, Ryan O'Neill, Ali McGraw, and Harvard. Yesterday, the three were reunited when McGraw and O'Neill met me on the Harvard campus to talk about another amorous performance, this time reading love letters at the Schubert Theater. You did this low-budget movie in 1970. 45 years ago, we've had this deep affection for each other. You come back and do this play, Love Letters, which is about a 50-year, long-distance emotional connection. My thesis is the former, in part, cause you to do the latter. Is that correct, Bingo, Ryan? Bingo, absolutely Are you making true. that up? I can't tell. Of course not. Why can't you tell? <laughs> no, but is that really part absolutely. of what the allure was for it you? You're shaking just... your head no while he's saying yes. Well, yeah, just Pay for no fun. attention just to for her. Fun. Because... It, it worked. It, we read it. It worked. Of course it should be Ali and I. Of course. What's, what are we waiting for? You did this before, didn't you? Didn't I you did do? it. I didn't know that. <laughs> years and years ago with a wonderful actor named Bob Foxworth in um, San Antonio. But, you know, the intervening many years have made me really love this script and understand it better. I can't imagine anybody better to do it with than Ryan. We have so many layers of shared experience. Would you have done it if he wasn't uh, uh, doing the other part? I, I don't think so. Would you have done it? Of if course. You... No. Now, would no, you no, have no, done no. it? <laughs> uh, no. I would not. You know, one no, of the things they, they presented me with a good script and with the woman of my dreams, Allie McGraw. And that's how they were presented with me. That was the end of it. You know, when I've read a lot about the interviews you've given <laughs> since you came back to do this thing, it's clear there's a deep affection. But from afar, it seems it's deeper with you than it is with you. Is no, that true or no? The thing is, I'm but you're more into her than she is. No, that, no, 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 no. Hello. Excuse hello, me. Hello, Here's I'm what sorry. the deal is. Yes. Now I'm, everyone knows. I don't discuss my private life oh. on this kind of a thing. I just oh. don't. I'm a fanatic about my privacy. So obviously, I adore Ryan. The details are not public stuff at all from me. But now I'll you, tell you. I was just going to say, go ahead. <laughs> no, stop. It's the truth. It's very different. You know, How? there's sort of an assumption that every breath we take should be fodder for every media outlet. And I don't, that's not how I was brought up. I don't up. like even telling people where I had lunch yesterday, so I can totally relate right? to what you're both talking about. You know, uh, when was the last time you saw a love story? You, when, I can't remember. Is that, that true? Decades ago. Is that really true? Yeah, yeah. How about you, Ron? This morning. <laughs> <laughs> You're so lying. When was the last time you saw a love story? I don't know. Many years. Many, I watched it last night. I keep the, he's so young. And, Who and is that guy? It is unbelievable. And I, and I stepped back for a second. I said, beyond the fact that it was obviously the movie of its time, I can't think of another movie other than maybe Winslet and DiCaprio and Titanic, which was a more important love story for the American people. It, how does that feel to you? In Alec? 1969, yeah. we were at war. Yeah, right. The, two, the world, our, uh, America was changing. Things were happening. And I think the audience was desperate, desperate for a romance mm -hmm. that they could relate to. And it turned out to be us. Did you have any idea that this was going to be bigger than just another movie with two really talented uh, I people? I hoped it was. And I could, I, I know that I was relating very much to my leading lady. And there seemed to be something between us that was uh, hot and, and, and paying off. And that, that is a good uh, tip that you might be onto something. <laughs> yeah. Really? Yeah. What? You never know? You didn't, I've never no. told you that? No, no, no. I wasn't thinking about that. I just do. Th you really had a clue that it might be bigger than just a. Uh, sure. Of wow. course I did. I didn't. Because I, I had the same kind of feeling when I was working with Mia Farrow on Peyton Place. There was something about this girl it was very, very intriguing and uh, interesting. Mm -hmm. How many men have told you it was the first movie they ever cried in? I not only cried when I was a kid when I watched this movie, I cried when I watched it yesterday. Oh. Wow. I know. it. I mean, it's pretty... Because it has, um, uh, I don't know, they say built-in built uh, buttons. You know, you that's press. why it was so strange for me when I first read it. I thought, oh, something's wrong. And I read it, I thought, oh, come on. You know, I'd read all this great literature in school. And so I immediately started it again and sobbed. And then called my agent and said, please see if you can get Paramount to do this picture for my tiny thing that I owed them a picture. And I knew that they would take good care of us. So. 
I have to make a decision here, and so, but I have to proceed it with a question. Have you ever done an interview together in which someone has not asked you about love means never having to say you're sorry? <laughs> You've never done remember. it? I don't think so. So I'm not going to ask, so and then get, I will be the first you ever. Will, and you'll be Is favorite. that from our film? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to do it. I'm probably going to take a lot of crap back so in the So excited. Feel good about that. Oh I tried God. to justify it, and so she's fresh. always going. You're both nominated for Best Actress, Best Actor in 1970, correct? Or and 70, don't you of? forget it. Uh, okay, uh, so fast forward to 2016. How do you feel about the controversy that is enveloping the Oscars in 2016, Ellen? Uh, they're know, getting squeezed. They're getting squeezed, and they're a big, big organization. They'll figure it out. Should they be squeezed? I don't think so. I don't think so. I mean, if there's a, I don't, I didn't see anything this year that I thought should be nominated that that featured. Well, I said no. I, I like come uh, out of Compton. They Straight said yeah, Compton's but those writers are white. <laughs> but Michael Jordan is pretty great in Creed, don't you think? Yes, they're all good. But on the Academy Elba. Awards, What's that? Idris Elba. Yeah. But you know, the problem is there are five spots, and look at that list. They're excellent, and so it becomes a conversation about is there. A large enough list for the number, but, you know. In in certain awards, there are more spaces. So yesterday, I spent a half hour. This is my charmed week. I spent a half inter, uh, hour interviewing somebody. Probably one of you is probably Jane Fonda. Is seventy the new twenty? I mean, it is <laughs> really. She's seventy-eight years old. Doesn't she look great? You guys are in your seventies. It's right. no secret. I mean, what's up? I mean, what is with the aging? You mean, thing? what drugs are we on that keep us? <laughs> No, but just you, just uh, uh, luck of the draw. When I say, if I had met you in 1970, like everybody mm -hmm. would like to, and I said someday we're going to sit down at Kirkland House at Harvard when you're in your 70s, and you're going to be doing love letters, you're still going to yeah. be great looking, and I would say to you, you promise. <laughs> <laughs> But, but when we were that young, no one believed you could be 70 no, and that, be that this. Was very Is that old. true? That was very old. It's not anymore. It's about about taking your health seriously. You know. I, I'm I, walking I, home to the hotel from here.